send a message to the country today. No, I don't see the sense in working. Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here, back in your life. And back in your life with another episode of the Minecraft. What the heck is going on, guys? Feels like it's been forever for me. Now, even in this crazy rain, we can still see this gorgeous sunset, but I should head for home. I just wanted to take a last look at this bad boy. I think three episodes running, we did this. We went west, straight into the sunset, found that big icy continent, explored most of it, and then came back east and, and north again. Uh, there could even be, for frick's sake, a giant arse continent in the middle of this this freaking thing. I feel like we would have seen a little bit of it, unless it can't be too big. But, uh, but dang, this, uh, this was fun. And guys, I will say, it feels honestly like it has been forever for me. The last three episodes, you guys have seen me exploring, uh, circumnavigating oceans. Well, we didn't circumnavigate anything. We circumnavigated that map, uh, I guess. And uh, you guys saw me get away from your stupid creeper. Not worth my time. I'll come kill you later. So, guys, it has been forever for me. I recorded those three in one sitting. So, for the last three weeks, you guys have been getting this. And, I don't know, for me at least, I spend as much time making videos for you guys as I can manage, right? And uh, so, I haven't had too much time to just play Minecraft for fun. And so, I'm excited to get back to it. Uh, I hope you guys liked the expedition, the traveling, and maybe that peek at that new building I gave you. Man, what a rainy, miserable old night in Ocean's Gate, eh? I guess this is probably the rainy season here. Um, I'm taking you guys all the way up to the top, and today we are going to be doing some uh, farming. A little bit, just almost more decorative than anything, but uh, one of you guys, uh, Aaron, I think he, his uh, Google Plus thing makes him look like Arn in the comments, which might be another way to say it. But um, he recommended uh, build, uh, planting some wheat on... Oh, I shouldn't go this way. I haven't finished the ladders yet. I keep forgetting. Um... Yeah, he recommended doing a little wheat on the hill behind this big old orange house up here, the one that I haven't built the uh, roof to yet. It's all the way, way up here on this plateau, uh, if you missed last episode. But guys, we are back. We are back here at the gate, and I should say, actually, let's just say this quickly before we go any further. I've been meaning to do it for ages, guys, but tonight I am going to do a live stream of Minecraft. So if you guys haven't been over to my Twitch uh, channel, and uh, you guys are fans of this series, Definitely check it out. Now, my game plan is to do it, I don't know, a couple hours after the stream comes out. Monday evening, but ideally not too late, because I know a few of you guys are uh, in the UK, Europe, and further around the world, so uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe three or so hours after the episode has come out. Uh, your time. It's around 11 my time. Uh, we're going all the way to the top here. So, keep that in mind, guys. I would love if you came and checked it out, because i got a lot to talk about today, and uh, I, don't, I won't have time. And, if we're going to do up all this hill, build the roof to this thing, landscape it up here, you know, build more buildings, dang, I'm going to need more time to do that too. So I'm dying to get a live stream, I'm dying to binge on some uh, Minecraft. In this time, guys, for me, it has been a fricked up long time, um, and it's a good thing. Uh, I, right before, uh, or right after I finished editing and uploading that trio of episodes, I, uh, by the way, we're planting some wheat back here. I think it's going to look good. Uh, that trio of episodes, I um, I actually, a lot has changed. I would, it sounds like an exaggeration, but I feel like a new man. A, uh, been, I have been a procrastinator, guys, for years. The kind of guy who, you know, like when I was a kid, let's say my mom's going out for the day, it's the summer, I get, before I'm working, uh, before I have summer jobs, and she says, why don't you go cut the grass? My old me would have just, every time, oh, what? screw off. Every time I just put it off, put it off, put it off. And we do that. Uh, that's where the root of procrastination is tasks we think are going to be unpleasant. Um, and that gives us reason to avoid them. And I've been doing that, guys, for years. And not just with simple stuff like, can I, oh, wrong tool. Uh, not with simple stuff like cutting the grass, but like important stuff, you know, uh, the kind of things that adults are supposed to take care of and not just be lazy with. Important stuff, too, not just mowing the lawn, kind of, uh, the important stuff that adults are actually supposed to take care of. So uh, I have actually kind of come to terms with where I've been slacking off in life. And last few weeks, I've really been kind of getting organized. And all the motivation really comes back to this channel. I, uh, I've mentioned to you guys, I'm hoping that uh, I can make this one of the biggest, best gaming channels on the planet. It's my And it's my aspiration to at least turn this into my job. And um, 
Uh, and I don't think I'll ever be able to do that if I'm slacking off at life. And I think this is going to sound a little bit silly because I know I'm not Sky or PewDiePie or any of the other big YouTubers, right? Uh, I know I'm not them. But I, th I try and think of Let's Plays as a little bit of an art form. I know that sounds probably a little nerdy, but you guys know the difference between a good one and a bad one. Let's say you're going online, even to find a build guide or something. There are guys that will ramble for half an hour with a terrible mic and an awful sounding voice, uh, and I guess there's nothing you can do about that. But there are guys who will do that, and you'll end up with, you know, a, a really hard to watch video, right? Then there's guys who who really care about it, and they'll make it as, you know, uh, s slick, enjoyable as as possible. They get it down to, uh, you know, five six minutes, and then they. Uh, they have a whole series of build guides and they link it to them because they're doing everything right because they really care about it. That's the way I try and think about it. And I think I'll probably never accomplish either dream of growing a giant audience or, you know, really making good videos. I don't think I'll ever get there if my mind is occupied with, oh, I should pay that bill. Oh, I really ought to call that person. Oh, why haven't I ever turned this broken keyboard or whatever, right? Those kind of things that we just put off and put off and put off. So, I mean, that's just one part of uh, what's been going on with me lately, guys. But, yeah, let's go all the way around here. Um, but it's changed things. I feel like a new guy. I uh, Honestly, if, you, if that sounds at all familiar, if you sound like you're hearing me and you're hearing shades of yourself, you're the procrastinator type, there's a hundred ways to do it. You can really only find the one that works for you. Any problem you're trying to solve in your life, bad habits, whatever, you really need the motivation. So there's no there's no way to really fake it uh, or to force itself on you. Uh, but one book I, I would recommend, if you are the type, uh, I don't... Uh, I know a lot of people love The War of Art uh, by Stephen Pressfield. It's really great for creative types, helping you get through the things that keep you from making great writing art whatever oh it's sunrise it stayed bright up here all night dang um if uh anyway if you are a creative person and you want to do your best work his his stuff is great i haven't actually read war of art yet but uh oh there we go um but uh i've been reading do the work which i mean that's it's hard to argue with that when i look at ocean's gate i think I gotta do the work. If I wanna be a prolific builder, if I want this to be a long running series, I gotta come in here on my off time and do some building. Really make this place look special. Cause I only get a few minutes on camera with you guys, or on audio with you guys, every fricked up week. Now speaking of that, I have freaking barely talked about anything I wanted to talk about. Uh, so, tonight guys is that live stream. Uh, I know this isn't the most exciting episode, I just planted some wheat and talked to you, but dang, it is good to be back. Uh, at the moment, I know there's only, you know, depending on the week, 10, 20, 30 of you guys that are watching this series pretty regularly, uh, but you guys are my favorites. You, uh, This is the first uh, series I started on this channel, and uh, I still don't have any plans to get rid of it, but I will say things will be changing. The whole motivation behind this me getting better at uh, handling real life it all comes down to making this channel better, and I have a move coming up. Uh, I'm going to be moving, I've hinted at it, but to an old farmhouse, one that was actually built by my great-great-grandfather. I'll be close to the city, but surrounded by just nature, like here, like here, out on the gate. Um, and I'm going to have more time, more time to do this, right? And I thought there's no point in, you know, changing up my life, moving somewhere different so that I can better pursue the dream of, of turning this channel into my job. Uh, there's no point in doing that if you don't have... Your shit together in life quote unquote um geeks thank you for watching this series i hope if you're liking what i'm doing up here uh, uh sort of uh landscaping wise on this hill if you're liking that or if you want to keep talking about this stuff tune in tonight i really don't almost don't care if, if people come if you guys do i'll love it but i've just been dying to play so much minecraft that that dang i'm just gonna do it i'm gonna go uh stream over on twitch it'll be the first link in your description there guys uh and it'll be a few hours after this episode comes out so it's only gonna reach the few of you that get it on uh, day one uh and you know what the reason is you should be following me on twitter and twitch that way you'll get notified when that stuff happens um but geeks love you thank you for watching this episode uh Thank you for uh, listening to me ramble. I love this episode. It's therapeutic, even. And uh, I'm going to keep talking about this stuff, uh, especially if you guys relate to it. Come on tonight, and we will catch up. Um, geeks, that's it. Thank you for watching this episode of Minecraft from Ocean's Gate. And tonight, we will be live from the gate. It's going to be great. I cannot wait. We will do a ton of stuff up here. That's it. I, as always, am United Queens, and I will see you geeks in the next episode.